Robin Hood, ticker symbol H-O-O-D. As you remember, I was in on this stock at eight, saying all the time, never any doubt whatsoever, it's a $40 stock. Here we are at 37. Should you be selling? Should you be, should you be taking profits? Does it really matter if it goes to 60, 100, a million? I don't know. If you bought it at eight and you made 40, got to 40, why not? Well, we have, a, we have a special guest on the show today, another YouTuber that has a great show of his own. Go and check him out. Uh, he's called Fight Channel. He's live on the show and he wants to talk about Robin Hood. I have no idea what he's going to say. It's completely unscripted. Shall we find out? And let's hear what he has. Has to, th- has to say about Robin Hood this morning. Uh, Fight Channel, good morning to you. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good. You, you want to talk to me about uh, Robin Hood? What do you have for me? Right. Uh, well, I put this in the link for Discord for YouTube yesterday. It's Robin Hood acquired Trade PMR for 30 million abuse advisor. Robin Hood had been pushing to grab market share for traditional brokers such as Charles Schwab and Fidelity Investment in an effort to become a full-fledged financial service provider. That's big news. Are you in the stock? Oh, I'm in the stock. Yeah, I bought it at average cost, 15, 35, 44 Ooh. shares. Nice. I got four option plays on it. Nice. What, are you planning on taking some profit or are you okay with this now? Mm, I'm only up. I'm up 140. percent I'm happy where it's going. You, yeah. Just like you said, um, beginning of the year, it could be a forty forty dollars stock. Yeah, that's right. It could be more. It could be that by the end of the year. I'm, yeah. I'm, and it could be fifty to sixty with this acquirement right here. Yeah. Let me uh, let me thank you for sharing this in. Let me just uh, share what you've just posted to me. I'll be right back to you. And we've right. got time. Just so don't go away. Uh, this is the post just sent in uh, by Fight Channel. If you are a member of our channel, you have access to Discord and you can share news. So your favorite stocks, your favorite crypto, I'll read them out. I'll cover it. Robin to acquire Trade PMR for $300 million to boost advisory business. Uh, Reuters retail trading platform uh, Robinhood will acquire portfolio management platform Trade PMR in a cash and stock deal for about three hundred million. The company said on on Tuesday. Now that's interesting, actually, because they mention here uh, cash and stock. That means part dilution. However, the stock is rallied. Now, normally, when you hear about these sort of stock deals, it can it can be negative for the stock, but people like it. Uh, the stock is rallied. It's not all stock. We don't know much about the deal so far. I'm reading it for the first time. Uh, maybe I'll learn something here. Robert has been pushing uh, to grab market share from traditional brokerages such as Charles. Schwab Fidelity Investments in its effort to become uh, to a full-fledged financial services provider. Over the past few months, Robinhood has unveiled a credit card, launched a desktop trading platform, added features and index options, trading and rolled out contracts for betting on the US presidential election. I did see that. I wasn't a great fan of that, but uh, anyway. Robinhood shares, uh, which were up 1.2% trading before the bell, have gained nearly 175% in 2024. The trade PMR acquisition expected to close in the first half of 2025 will help Robinhood's customers find and connect to registered investment advisors, RIAs. Robinhood's client base is the next generation of investors. We believe this acquisition allows us to build a multi-generational platform that will help introduce financial advisors to this next generation, said Rob Baldwin, founder and CEO of Trade PMR. Let's see if I'm able just to get rid of that little advert there. That's better. Uh, much better, isn't it? Uh, our RIAs uh, advise clients uh, uh, and may manage their assets in a fiduciary capacity, that is. They act in the best interest of their clients. The RRI, RIA market is a $7 trillion industry, the company said. Trade PMR has more than 40 billion assets under management, it said on Tuesday. City was Robinhood's financial advisor while Trade PMR was advised by Lazard. There you go. Very, very interesting. Uh, this came out uh, yesterday, I think it was, Fight, I think mm-hmm. you were saying. 
uh, and uh, the stock is up 4.77 today. Very, very nice indeed. I want to first of all thank you very much for sending me uh, this link this morning. I am bullish. Uh, we were in at eight dollars. I sold mine when I moved into the S and P fully. Uh, is is Robinhood in the S and P yet? I don't think it is. Is it? Do you know? I'm not sure offhand. Not sure. I don't think it is. Um, but I would love to see it join the S and P because I'll be I'll be owning it anyway. Or but are that's right. They are a New York Stock Exchange, right? Yes, they are. Nasdaq. Okay. They, yeah, they would be great before S and P five hundred. Such the way they've been growing this year. Yeah. I mean, year to date. Is uh, 106, what, 189% this pretty year good, alone. I remember all the hate that they were getting because of the for, for GameStop, and I said that's absolute nonsense. And I've said, and I'll say it again as we talk, it's going up again. I said at the time what Robin Hood did might not be very nice for you, for you gambling on GameStop, sat on the toilet but it's the responsible thing to do. They weren't the only ones to stop trading. You have to stop. You have to pull the circuit breaker sometimes. Otherwise, there's no way to pay out everybody. Now, of course, if you're a gambler and you don't care and you just want to pump a stock forever and ever and ever and up and up and up, then you get frustrated when they stop you trading. But any brokerage, lots in fact did it, but Robinhood got all the flack for it because they were, you know, a lot of young investors who were just do, just, just using Robinhood for the first time to gamble with GameStop, who don't understand how the market works, got all up to you about it and started shouting about it and sharing it over Reddit and everyone else saying, Robinhood's a scam and it's rubbish. Well, it's proved that it's not a scam. It's not rubbish. I have all my money in it. I love it. It's a great business. It's going to get better. Is it perfect? No. Vlad Tenef always says the right thing. No. Does any CEO always say the right thing? No. You know what I mean? But uh, it's a good one. So you're 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 in and are you holding or are you looking to take some profit now? I'm holding, but I think that incident with GameStop was more of a blessing than an incident because we're looking backwards at it now. It brought the stock down from forty dollars down to eight dollars where we could buy it at. Then get the run up now. I mean, exactly. Very, very true. If we'd not had that GameStop instance, I think just like always, we probably would have dropped off the IPO price because at that time, stocks were dropping off IPO prices. But at the end of the day, other than, of course, Rivian, which did ridiculous, but now look at it. Um, no, you're right. It's, it's given great opportunity. Um, so, yeah, it's actually a blessing for investors. Uh, all of those I mean, that gambled and got and one of our families put in a comment. He he made seventy four percent off of Robin Hood so far. Yeah, yeah. I even mean, if you only bought it recently. Yeah, I mean, only, uh, yeah. I mean, not if you only bought it three months ago, you'd be up eighty one percent. It's not bad, is it? No. Sometimes I mean, I'll be honest. Sometimes it's tough being me only in the S&P. When you watch these stocks every day and you're really confident and, you, and, you've, and you've studied it and you've followed all the earnings and you've covered it, covered it more than anyone, you know it. And you know Robin Hood inside out. And you think, I, you know, I, <laughs> why don't I own this? But uh, there you go. I've got a bigger plan. The plan is to provide the service to the, to the viewer right. and grow the channel than just my own personal trades. Um, but anyway... Thank you for letting us know. Brought that to my attention. I was able to get that out, and that'll go out as a video by itself. Fight Channel, always a pleasure having you call in. Appreciate right, it. Thanks. And thank you for your service, as always. <laughs> there you go. Brilliant stuff. Fight Channel uh, live on the show. And as you can see, Robin Hood is still going up. Wonderful, 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 wonderful. Click above your head. Click above my head for all the links, not your head. Don't click above your head. There's nothing there. There's just space. All right. Click above my head. There's stuff. If you can't find it, go in the, de the description, click more, and you'll see the above my head clicks. Some people go, I can't find the above my head clicks. I'm going to complain. Don't complain. Well, you can complain when you want. I've got a filing cabinet for that. You want to complain to the management, send in your complaints. This is the filing cabinet. It goes in here, and I promise to get back to you at my earliest convenience. There's no complaints here. Deal with it. Click above my head, or don't. Down below in the description, or not. Over here, you'll find the Robin Hood playlist, or not. And down here, something else, or not. Until next time, take care of yourselves and each other.